Hello, it's so nice to have you here. My name is Jessie. I'm the maker and the designer from Jessie's Designs. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I want to talk to you about my latest pattern release, the Sawyer Heel Beanie. Look at it. It is a design that features a fair aisle pattern, and I'm featuring also yarn from Lion Brand Yarns, Wool and Ease. It's a worsted weight yarn, and maybe if you are a knitter, usually there is a little place in our shelves or in your storage area where you just have partial skeins of yarn. So I, like you, have so many of those, and I wanted to design something where all of these partial skeins would become very handy. What better design than a fair aisle pattern? If you know me, or if you're familiar with my work, you know that most of my fair aisle patterns are inspired by my home country in Colombia. Growing up on the coast, on the Caribbean, I was surrounded by many indigenous communities, and the work that they did with their art in featuring different ways of working with fibers was also something that I found mesmerizing. So today I find myself including so much of the work that I saw growing up and this is no exception. And this fair aisle work is something that makes me feel closer to home and it's designing the hopes that you also get a little bit of what I grew up with in Colombia, some of that sense of art and inspiration for your own work. Now for this pattern, for the Sawyer Hill Beanie, you may use two colors, uh, the main color that it's featuring the brim and you bring through the project and a contrasting color. Now my testers, the wonderful ladies that helped me test this pattern for you to be ready now, they include Included so many different variations. Some of them they work with yarns which the contrast in color was variegated so you could see for example a dark main color like black and then you have all the bright colors in the background. This is a pattern for you to have fun with. If you are a knitter you like me have so many partial skeins of yarn. Usually there is a section in your shelves or in your storage area where you have these little balls of yarn I have two big baskets full of it, so I found myself reaching out to this medium weight yarn, to the worsted weight yarn, in so many different colors, and I was having so much fun pairing them together. Actually, what you don't see, it's over here on my desk. I have about 20 of these color combos that I could put together with my partial skeins of yarn, and I'm hoping to turn them all into Sawyer Hill beanies. Officially, I have all of my other projects on hold because it feels so satisfying when you see these two big baskets of yarn that I have just going down because I'm reaching out and finding good use for these partial skeins. I hope that you find yourself enjoying working on this project, that you have fun with the color combos that you put together for your own Sawyer Hill beanie. And one thing that I also love about this pattern, including the decrease, it's the beauty in the details, right? I hope that you really find yourself making these for so many of your family members, for gifts. It's great if you're working on markets because it's the kind of pattern that works great for both men and women. So I'm gonna show you now some examples or some samples that I have worked on for my Sawyer Hill beanie. So this is one where I'm working with Lion Brand Wool Ease. This one still has to be blocked. I haven't blocked it yet, but it's in a beautiful shade of navy blue. So the main color, it has different tones, as you can see there. It has blues, darker, lighter. It has a little bit of gray. So at some point, you can see that gray showing up and kind of mixing together with the yarn that I use for the contrasting color, which is a gray. But when you see this hat from far away, it has a beautiful, beautiful color effect. By the way, most of the samples that I'm working on for the Sawyer Hill Beanie 
are going to be available on my website as ready to ship pieces. All of these are one of a kind. I have worked on all of these through the project, through working with my testers and in the process of designing this beanie. So a lot of the ones that you're going to see here are right now on my website. It's jessiesdesigns.com and you can go to the ready to ship section there. You're going to see everything that I have ready right now for you to purchase, including my newest design, the Sawyer Hill Beanie. So take a look at that. Now, this is another sample also using wool ease from Lion Brand. You can tell that I'm into the blues lately and I have a couple more on my, on my desk that are going to be also in navy blue. Look at this one. I don't even know what to say about this one because it's the kind of colorway that screams fall. As I posted in one of my, my posts on Instagram showing this beanie, it's like if you're going to get lost in the woods. You could get lost in the woods with this beanie. I absolutely love it. Let me show it closer to you. So the main color is Woolanese from by Lion Brand Yarn. But the contrasting color, I cannot tell you what it is. I got this yarn as a gift a little while back and it didn't have a tag. So I don't know what yarn company made this one. If I knew which one it is, I would have purchased more of this because it's absolutely beautiful. If you're looking at this video and you know which yarn this is, please send me a direct message on my Instagram or let me know in the comments below what yarn you think that is because it's absolutely beautiful. These are some of the ones that I have ready right now. Some of the other ones still have to be blocked as well. I'm working on this one right now. This main color is from Cascade Yarns and the contrasting color is from Malabrigo. Look at this. It looks like... Ah, oh, it looks like a dream. I'm absolutely, absolutely having the best time working on this beanie. It's it, just the color effect is absolutely beautiful. So I'm very close to just finish with the beanie and I will have it up very soon on my website. Or by the time this video is out, it might be there already, along with the other ones that I'm working on as well. So again, I hope that you love working on this design. You can read more about it on my blog. It's there on my website, jessiesdesigns.com. You can read more about the inspiration behind the Sawyer Hill Beanie. I hope that you have the best time working on your Sawyer Hill Beanie. Make it a cozy time. Usually I have instrumental music in the background. I'm diffusing my essential oils from doTERRA just to add to that cozy feeling. And it's such an inviting time in my day. Now, before you go, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so. Turn on the notifications so you can know when new videos come up. And happy knitting!